conversation about the Aaron Douglas Art Fair coming up on September 24th from 10 to 5. One of the artists, and yes, I will call you an artist even though you're only you're doing kid songs, because <laughs> playing music is an art in itself. Kyler Carpenter is uh, going to be playing some for the kids this that weekend. Uh, how are you doing? I'm doing really well. Thank you. Good, good. Okay, so you specialize just in kids' music, you tell me. I specialize in that. I, <laughs> I can branch out, and it all really began with playing bar songs and coffee shop songs. But, <laughs> so I kind of fell backwards into playing for kids, and I can't imagine my life without it at this point. So what made you want to just uh, switch to just playing kids' songs? I moved in the library. I work at the library in mm -hmm. Topeka and um, moved over to the children's department and hadn't ever really thought about focusing in on kids music but once i did that um i chose to to go that route and i find um a lot of fun and a lot of enjoyment and the, the crowd's much easier to uh much more forgiving <laughs> than the bar crowd would be so if you hit the wrong chord <laughs> you're not gonna hear boo no, the stage, <laughs> never boo. never never <laughs> and and so what what songs do you what, what are the most popular songs that you sing um I have I probably know about 300 songs, um, kid songs, and I, there's times when I can't think of a single one of them in, in my head. But the really popular ones involve a lot of movement. Um, there's a fish song where we sw we swim and the clapping your hands, stomp stomping your feet kind of songs, and any kind of dancing song always goes over really well. Oh yeah, the kids love that stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, now, so I, I hate to I hate to put you in the same category as the Wiggles, but is that about <laughs> the same thing that that we're talking about here? Yeah, yeah, I would love to have that kind of success, but. <laughs> We got to get the the multicolored outfits too. You right, know, if you're going to be a wiggle, but, and three other people. <laughs> but uh, with the, with the kids, if they come up and say, "Well, will you do Twinkle Twinkle Little Star" or something like that? Are you able to do that? You betcha, no wow. problem at all. In fact, if I start a story time and some kids approach me before story time and ask me to do songs, I it, that's thrilling to me. That that I no doubt about it. We're going to do that song somewhere in the. I'll try to fit it into the theme somewhere. And have you had many kids do that? Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah. I've, I'm really lucky. I've been doing it a long time, though, too. So I'm lucky to know a lot of uh, families. And, and now I have big brothers that come in. They're 9, 10 years old, and they come in with their little brother or sister. And it's, that's what I think is a really special thing when a, when uh, somebody's being a, a good big brother or big sister and have really aged out of enjoying, for their own purposes, you know, the story time. But they'll, they'll, they know that their little brother or sister would really enjoy it if they sat there with them. And I really like that. I, I'll point that out. I'll just, I'll, after the story time, I'll go over and give them a high five and say, good job being a big brother. I have a big brother that's eight years older than me and did so many wonderful things for me when I was, I was a kid that I didn't really notice until we got older. Now we're best buddies. So that's perfect. Yeah. And like so said. you you do this at the Topeka Public Library how often? Um, I get to do my own musical story times the second and fourth Saturdays of every month and then the third Friday. So the second and fourth Saturdays, we're really looking at families um, early morning, getting out on a Saturday morning, maybe going to the farmer's market and coming by the library and and getting around Topeka and doing any of the one of the number of things that are happening in this community. Anybody that says there's nothing going on in this town, they don't is, know. They're, they're not looking. <laughs> You are, again, going to be playing September 24th. From uh, from what time at the art fair will you be there? I start at noon, and every I've done this for, I think, shortly after the Aaron Doug, Douglas Art Fair began. And it's it's really uh, kind of impro imp improvised. It's kind of improvised depending on um, how, what kind of, how many kids are there. One year I had some teenage boys get up on stage, and they were dancing behind me. So it depends. Uh, there's a little gap in between my the time I'm supposed to be there. But 12 to 1230, I think, is... Is my guaranteed time, but it might go on to twelve forty-five, depending on how much fun we're having. Well, you brought in a guitar, so you're gonna have to play us a song. I would love to play a Let's, song. Uh, Laura, <laughs> what are you gonna play for us? Um, I can tell that we're gonna be friends. It's a White Stripe song, and it's just a nice, gentle song. I I do Vias every Wednesday night from six uh -huh. to seven. I don't know if you mind me plugging that, but <laughs> yes, that, it's please. usually the song I kick off with. There, it uh -huh. just kind of sets a tone. And the, when the kids, some kids just aren't into music right away, but as they feel it and get to know it and as i'm looking over there and what my words are i can tell that we are going to be friends they, it just opens them up right awesome. away so it's a great song to, to kick off an event with well i can tell we're going to be friends so <laughs> let's kick off some music all right fall is here hear the yell back to school and ring the bell brand new shoes and walking blues books and pens climb the fence I can tell that we are gonna be friends I can tell that we are gonna be friends walk with me Susie Lee 
by the park and through the trees we could rest upon the ground and look at all the bugs we found safely walk to school without a sound safely walk to school without a sound well, here we are no one else walk to school all by ourselves there's dirt on our uniforms from chasing all the ants and worms we clean up and now it's time to learn we clean up and now it's time to learn numbers letters learn to spell nouns and verbs and show and tell a playtime we could throw the ball back to class and through the hall teacher marks i hide against the wall teacher marks i hide against the wall we don't notice any time pass because we don't notice anything we sit side by side in every class She thinks it I sound funny, but she likes it when you sing. Tonight I'll sleep while I'm in bed. Silly thoughts will run through my head. We're gonna let Kylie keep playing. And we'll be back here in a minute when on I wake WIBW tomorrow, News Now at noon. You and I could walk together again. Cause I can tell that we are gonna be friends. Cause I can tell that we are gonna be friends.